way up. Hey there, everyone. This is Alcal playing uh, WarioWare, doing some grid, and I did not press start there. I pressed the action button. I can't believe it. Last time, man. Um. Oh, did I read that? Hey, are you? It's Cat and Anna, but only Cat's name appears up there. When you're playing our games, you just remember that all living things are created equal. I don't know, that monkey seemed pretty powerful. If you forget, we might have to bust out our ninja skills on- Well, that seems a bit- This seems a bit extreme. I don't know, maybe it's just me. Anyway, I don't know if I'll ever beat a score of 540. I mean, I guess we might have another sort of infinite loop going on. I don't know. Munch a bunch, clear 20 points. You're a hungry monster. Eat as much as you can. As fast as you can. Chomp. Is this just button mashing? Yeah, we're mashing. All right, so yesterday I ended with mashing. Today we start with mashing. So the game just outright calls this little guy a monster. That seems pretty rude. He's like clearly reptilian in nature, maybe a turtle, what with like like the, the bop on the back, you know, it's got like a hunchback there. Like, it's just a, a turtle with a very, very large head, with both eyes on side of his head. Maybe it's because it's got four eyes, you know, two sets on each side. I don't know, maybe it's because it's a doodle of some kind. Like, it's a turtle, but it's a doodle representation, and it's not a literal, like, actually this is what it looks like. So the representation. Anyway, we're chopping, we're eating all the shapes, keeping healthy, eating shapes. Uh, that is the turtle way. See, this seems a lot harder than monkey because you need to do more than three hop every time. And at higher speeds, higher levels are going to be genuinely pretty difficult. Because, yeah, look at how many shapes that to be eaten. Like, you need a tap. You need to do some serious tapping. Like, level one, kind of free. But level three, you know, there's a lot, so you gotta take a little bit of break between meals sometimes, you know, gotta save that energy. But then you go, it's like, alright, you know what, I'll take a quick snack between bites then, you know, sort of pace myself. Uh, and that is how you make it through the environment. Uh, I keep forgetting that level two exists, <laughs> I don't know, like, I noticed level one, because it's so short, I know this level 3 because it's so long, but level 2 just kind of happens in between the Gen X of meals. Just everyone just kind of doesn't acknowledge them. It's fine, I guess. I mean, I guess what the turtle really wants to eat is like the weird like little sun thing in the end. Like the re Oh, see that? I didn't tap fast enough, but like at some point, like... At some point, there's a limit to what my thumb can achieve. I guess I could spoon it, but like I'm not gonna bring out the spoon for for this mini game. I mean, I guess if I wanted to go to the absolute highest rank I ever could, uh, then yeah, we'd be spooning this like absolute. Wow, I wasn't even anywhere close. Uh, I mean, I I I, I, I destroyed. The, the, the point requirement though, so like all that, it's all good, don't worry about it. Flying Squirrel! Picture perfect! 10 points, this one's a timing one. Snap a photo of the passing object. Remember to center the subject. Object and subject, they kind of rhyme. Yeah, this is a timing one, right? Whoa, so I might be more quiet? Because, like, other levels already go pretty fast, I reckon. That's a swallow! Yeah, beautiful picture of a little bird gliding by. Okay, that was not nearly as fast as I thought it'd be. What?! That was a perfect picture of a gliding plane, Wario. You have, like, no taste at all. So, because, like, a pixel of the nose was was off the thing like you're gonna do a thing about it like i mean i get it a game wouldn't be able to tell the difference but still also like that thing that object is kind of large like it expands out like compared to the flying squirrel here uh relatively compact shape the swallow too you know oh yeah see that one i get it. this one i get what you're telling me all right so i'm gonna want to press earlier 
then feels natural. Understood. Whoa, I'm Rocky. This is such a cheerful looking little critter. All right, whoa, there we go. That, that bird goes fast. Like that bird, and I won. I think it's 10 points, right? So I won. I did it. Here's a plane. The beautiful, the redwood plane. It just kind of shows up in the woods and will try to land on your head. We don't know why. Does that count? That counts. Pixels were out. Whoops, I just pressed the button immediately. <laughs> Look at my sweet photo of nothing. <laughs> it's not even the sky. It's just empty and white. Oh boy, yeah, at this point, things go pretty fast. Like, you have to anticipate. You, I think, like, you can't time. You have to anticipate. And I anticipated badly. But I don't care. I got my points. Am I good? One shot, one victory. Here's a mouse in the glass. Mouse trap! 15 point. Drop the trap from above and catch the mouse. Do you like my AI reading here? Drop trap. I kind of remember that. Yeah, little guy. And then, you know, like, I feel like that would have landed on its head and hurt the mouse, but luckily it backed off. There we go. Hey, we heard the song before. It's like one of those WarioWare songs during a minigame. Okay, and it's just the trap you get is now so small that you can plainly see the tail of the mouse sort of like pushing outward of the glass. We got ourselves like polygons sort of fighting even though this is entirely sprite based. Love it when that happens. There you go. Yeah, see, like, you can clearly see it. Like, that's just... That is the absolute smallest ob- Whoa. I, I'm not comfortable with the way that the mouse sort of, like, gets pulled back there. Oh, that one, that one's free. It's not even, like, level three one. Oh, whoops. I, okay. Uh, I forgot how to time this. It's all good. It's not. Uh, da -da. So weirdly enough, I feel like I need to do it immediately. If I wait for another round, I, 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 I don't know. Like, I don't, I'm not able to do it. It, it needs to come from the left. Otherwise, I, 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 ah, oh, and then, you know, it's not mess it up. I mess it up. I did a bad job. That's what it boils down to. I don't know. I, I, it needs to come from the left. Otherwise, I, I can't do it. I don't know why. Nope, I don't got it. I don't got it because it, I, 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 it's, I need, it needs to come from the left, otherwise I feel weird about the timing. And because it started off going leftward, and at, at that speed, you don't have time to uh, go around. So I can't, I cannot wait on it to reset its timing. So if, if it starts, yeah. Like, I, I, I'm gonna have to just... Cause see, normally it does that. It starts on the left of the screen, moves left, then double backs and goes right. And that I can time relatively easily, but you know, uh, there's instances where I felt like it didn't do that, and I just couldn't adapt. I, no, I think it always does that, but I was just too slow. No, see there? It started over more on the right, and then it kind of like, it went all around. Well, there I just missed. I don't know why you're holding that glass bowl so high up, Wario. I don't think it's necessary. Uh, oh, wow, and I even missed, all right. 13, oh, I think I won. No, no, that was not guaranteed. Now it's guaranteed, okay. We did it. I mean, it's fine if I missed, it's, I'm okay with that. I know, I'm not even, I mean, yeah, like, you need to sometimes safely capture a mouse because, uh, you know, it, the thing is, they're, they're super cute, they're adorable, they're friendly little animals, but they will get in your food and spread contamination if you give them the channel. Like, that's just, that's just the grim reality of what it is to be a mouse. So, you know, as a human, in order to protect human things, it is necessary to at least try to relocate them. But I did it. Fruit fall. It's the fall of the fruit. Catch the falling fruit in your basket. Be careful, cause it's not always fruit. All right, just move. Move the basket to get a thing. 
Look at that. Uh, that's a fruit. Right, right. In this game, you get a choice sometimes. Sometimes you get, you get two fruits. Don't get the diamond. You don't want to get a diamond. That would be ridiculous. That's not really bad. I guess it can be a basket. It's a line. So level three, it's harder because the two fruits are the same? I guess they're no. See here, the two grapes are the same. I don't know. What are the difference in levels? Uh, oh. I'm gonna move over to the side and get myself a diamond instead, and then run away. Uh, Alright, well, yo, check it out, I got a thing, and then I'm gonna stand here with all of my frames. Uh, mini frames of animation of this weather. Oh, man, this, this is one of the harder games. You know, you got, I mean, it's like, yeah, like, look up. Is it fruit? Don't move. Uh, is it a diamond? Move. There you go. I have mastered this video game. I mean, at some point, I'm gonna get God. So, you know, you can't sleep on your whiskers. That would be very uncomfortable in many ways. Okay, but like, for real though, like, like I need to, I feel like when I detect that the thing is a diamond, I feel like I'm not moving fast enough. Um, because, like, the reality is I can move in any direction if I do see one, but I do need to do that move, though. Oh, no, here was two diamond days. Those are... I feel like those are kind of rare. Anyway, I won. I got 20. Uh, <laughs> barely kind of aware of it. But, yeah, okay, sometimes it's a two diamond day, you know? Whoa! Violence here. Look at that, you know? That thing just kind of fell in your wagon and it's like, you just kind of trip over. No, diamonds are pretty mad. At that size, I feel like a diamond would be pretty heavy. I don't know though, but like, I feel like it would be pretty heavy stone. So yeah, having that land on your basket over your head would probably throw you off balance. I mean, it would create some form of physical reaction for sure. Uh, I, just, I just let it happen there. Like, oh, I, 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 like, I, I, I was like, oh yeah, those are two diamonds. Whoops! There I moved into the diamond somehow. How? Why? Because I... Oh no! Because the two fruits were the same. Even though they're frequently the same. Like, at some point, what the game tests is your brain's ability to discern images. And I think the lesson here is that at this time of day, when I haven't been awakened for that long, my ability to discern objects using a very limited scope of detail isn't all that great. I remember this game. I like this game. Worm Squirm, 20 points. You gotta figure out which swarm you are. Help get the worm to the water. Wiggle to see yourself. Then squirm for it and move. Yeah, like the challenge here is that, like, which worm are you? You are the only one who shall live. The other ones are gonna get dried up and get eaten by birds. Whoa! Look at that little squirmy little hands. So go right now. Get a sense of where you are, and then you go in. Like like you all. Oh, you gotta be. Uh, you gotta be. See, see, see. The other game, it was like, can you discern lim like details and undetailed shape, which which is a visual skill. This one is, can you discern, you know, amongst the tapestry. Of movement which one is the one that is moving differently and like you're the one making it move differently so that does give you a bit of an advantage oh, see we're in the back see sometimes like oh well you're you're the lighter ones but that's not always okay there you go yeah you do a little wormy dance then you go inside of the footprints you know level one is just absolutely silly there's like nothing going on I feel like if I were to go outside though there were that many worms like squirming around like that like this that would freak me out. I I would not like to see that. I would prefer not being witness to this. Is it possible? I mean, yeah, it is possible to have just like a whole bunch of worms together, but I mean, I feel like it's like not a very usual thing. Well, I mean, no, yeah, like they come out of the ground after rainfall. Cause they're like, wow, it's water. I'm gonna go and have a drink by exposing my skin to it. I don't know, I don't, I am not sure how worms absorb water. Animals at that side, like the rules just sort of not matter all that much, but worms have a mouth. Like the, the front of their cells is a mouth. So, so they probably just absorb water the way you would expect it. But I don't know, I don't want to assume anything. 
Uh oh, whoa, okay, so I this time I had trouble spawning myself not because it was spe specifically dense with worms Because it was all the way in the corner and uh, I've been looking more around like sort of the middle like not all the way in the corner That's ridiculous. Why would I play as a corner worm? That's just a bad idea. Like I don't think that build is very viable. Not count it. Uh, what? Whoa! I did not interpret my guy properly. Cause see, one of the worms was like halfway in the water already. Whoa! Okay, that one. Uh, oh, this is going pretty fast. It's pretty hard now. Whoa! Yeah. See, by the time I noticed myself, it's too late. In my squirming, I actually moved away from it because you know I didn't know. But I still got double my quota. It's a, it's a bird that jumps, right? Crackdown! 10 points. It's a hard one. Your egg is fragile. Jump over the trembling ground to keep your egg from breaking. Jump! I love to jump. Check it out. It's Jump Bird. Check it out, Jump Bird. Why? Why is a giant hammering this massive hammer? I don't know. Whoa! Okay, so that doesn't count. Uh, so what's the difference between levels then? Probably like the speed of my hover? Not the speed, but like the length of it? It's hard to tell actually, because like, all I do is I press jump. Faked it! Rude. Like, I feel like I need to at least get the first three levels, right? So he does go, uh. Does that matter? Can I use that sound as a tell? I don't know yet. So is it always gonna be a fake out? On level three? I don't know, because if he always fakes out then that's gonna be easy. But I feel like if he always fakes out, then like it just kind of becomes too easy? In a funny little way? Well, we'll find out now. Okay. See, I find this speed easier than the starting speed. Whoa. Like sometimes being slower makes it harder, especially when we're talking about timing, like a button press. I love that giant though. Like, what is up with him? I want his backstory. Where is the WarioWare in game lore encyclopedia? Well, I mean, considering it's this game, they're probably gonna say something silly. I'm not gonna get the answers I want. Instead, it would focus on, like, what is their favorite store at the mall instead. Because malls are still pretty active back when this game was released, I'm pretty sure. It's not like nowadays, where, I mean, if you're in a large city or like a college town, and you got a mall around, it has a chance of surviving. But like, that's pretty much it, though. Like, if you're, if, if you're like one of more like, whoa, rural malls, like, forget about it. You are seeing the massive, decrepit corpse of once was... A titan. I pressed the button there, but I pressed it too late. Whoa, and there I pressed it too early. It's pretty good. 25. I mean, I got I got double. Like, anytime I get double, I'm like, well, I can't realistically expect better than double. Look, and also, I started talking about malls that distracted me. Nothing is distracting quite like the idea of malls as uh, the, the, you know, Whoop and I uh, messed up. I forgot it was a double hammer, and so I died. I just love to think about malls as like, you know, malls are future dungeons. They are the fallen bodies of titans of the past. Like, that's what that looks like. Maybe it's a bit grim, but I find it's grim in a, like, kind of poetic way, honestly. I don't know. It's just something that I find interesting.